missed by Galloway. The rebound for Robert Morris. Pass it the other way, puts up a three. Rattles in good. Robert Morris cuts the deficit to three. Three points for Isabel Passet. Possett, the freshman from nearby Beaver, Pennsylvania, shows up big there. Penetration, then a kick back. Nice ball movement by Delaware State, and it's finished down on the low blocks by Pollard, and Charlie Biscaya wants to take a timeout. Colonials break on a steal, but that leaves the player open, and Ash puts up the three-pointer and makes the Colonials pay. Robert Morris is down 10. Skying for the rebound. E.K. Matsu, the other way go the Colonials. Castillo finds a streaking. Villafor up and in it goes, and Robert Morris cuts the deficit to six. And that all started with the outlet pass by E.K. Back to Augustin. A screen gets Augustin free and fins up. The three-pointer makes it a one-point game. Right around the screen by Ozzy Mamadou. Good job. All she needed was just a little bit of space to pull the trigger, and Augustin able to knock down the three. Robert Morris back within one. 17 to 16, your score. Penetration by Ash as the Hornets have grown cold lately. Pollard pulls up, cans along two, and the Colonials down three. Near sideline, E.K. Monsu inside, Ozzy Mamadou. Feeds Pluvios, and she finishes, and she's headed to the free throw line. Nice post to post interior passing. Ozzy Mamadou looking opposite, finding Pluvios with inside position. And it's a nice job by Pluvios, how she was able to get in front of Pass it up high. They allow her to shoot the three, and she misses. Rebound somehow finds its way into the hand of Azebo. She goes up and finishes. I think it was a little tip drill between Azebo and Villaflor. Near sideline, Pass it. Azebo to Castillo for three. That one, nothing but net, and the Colonials are up a half dozen. Oh. Well, Delaware State has to account for Esther Castillo. That was the third or fourth opportunity she's had. Well, it was wide, wide open. Wide sideline, Augustin. Augustin outside. Castillo for three. That one rattles in good, and the Colonials stretch their lead to nine. 32 to 23. Now steps past the defender and kicks it back. Villafor rifles one inside. Ozzy Mamadou gets separation, goes up with the left, and the Colonials back up by nine. Shot clock is off as there's 10 seconds to play here in the second quarter. Nice off the bounce goes Ash. Carrasco was so busy bodying up or uh, facing up her defender. Three seconds. Two seconds, jump shot, up and in for Finn, and Robert Morris takes a double-digit lead into the locker room. RMU overcomes a 10-point deficit halfway through quarter number two, or quarter number one, rather, and then takes an 11-point lead. Up it comes, E.K. Matsu pulls up. Long two for her, for her, and she cans it, and Robert Morris is up a baker's dozen. Jumper in transition, little jab step to open up. High left, penetrates, and then pulls it back out. Sharp has it stolen away. The Colonials run two on one. Feedback, pass it up and in, and the Colonials run in transition. They finish, and it's timeout time for David Caputo and the Delaware State Hornets. Now textbook two on one there. Get the lead a little more comfortable here. Adams up high. Trying to back down a defender. Pushes a shot up and in her first field goal of the game. Yeah. Oh. Under four minutes to go here. Robert Morris is up 13. It's Ash between the rings for the Hornets. Adams to the far sideline. Three point shot. Rattles in good for Nina Augustin. Through the lane, too many hands, too many things can get deflected there. You just want to take that dribble on to the next. That was the strong defense there by Villafor. There was nothing she could do on that fadeaway. 28 out of 46. That's more than half. Nice finish down underneath. Penetration up and in off the glass by Castillo. Back the other way come the Hornets. Three-point shot, nets in good, and the Robert Morris lead is down to four. Yeah, again, dangerous time for, for Robert Morris. 
Nia Adams for three, high right side, a hand in her face, but she still splashes it. And the center. And the Hornets look like a confident basketball team similar to the one that started off this game. Shot up and in. For Forcing many of her opportunities, just does it within the flow of the offense and, and is doing a, a great job and really confusing and, and getting around a lot of these Robert Morris defenders. And for the first time in a long time, Robert Morris scores and they do it feeding the post. Far sideline, Augustin, up high, Castillo. Steps in, runner, two drops into the cylinder, and Robert Morris back on top. Ash off of the screen, onto the baseline. Pollard's jumper is up and in, senses the screen. And the Colonials with a punch away, but it stays with Delaware State. Shot clock down to one, a long three, a glass ball, a shot clock violation. Now Augustin pauses and kicks it back, Castillo. Steps around a screen, jump shot, no good. Rebound, Ozzie Mamadou up and in with seven seconds to go. Here comes Delaware State, down by one. Ash to the near high left side. It irons off, no good. Robert Morris wins, 64 to 63. It wasn't pretty, but the Colonials get the win over the Hornets.